Hi, it's the first day of DIY today. I just want to say uh, I feel like I've been like out of the game for um, too long now because I'm as I was editing this video I was like shit these shots look bad so please bear with me in 2016 I want to re rebrand myself work on my uh, editing and my image and I'm um, you know maybe hopefully I can finally get into Final Cut Pro and stuff like that so that I can produce better quality content but I know sometimes you just have to work through it and I do want to put these videos out still because I am pretty happy with the things that I've done for them. Um, some of them are very simple as in past years the DIYs have been like stupid simple or um, things that people have already done but it's just like my take on them so I hope you still enjoy them. But today it's the first day and it's the lace face dress inspired by Christopher Kane fall winter 2015. Christopher Kane did these really cool dresses and other garments that had uh, lace and velvet faces, hands, bodies, penises on them. Semi-controversial uh, for some people but I thought they were really cool and I initially wanted to do this with velvet but I realized it would f like fray and um, be more difficult to work with because you'd have to do some sort of hemming situation on the faces or the body parts. So I went with lace and it's a little bit different than the inspiration but I think it turned out still pretty cool so hope you enjoy it. Let's get into the tutorial. So you're going to need a dress or any other plain garment, a couple different colors of lace or any non-fraying fabric of your choice, scissors, needle and thread. First you have to sketch out the shape that you want for whatever body part or head you're doing. I decided to do the faces. Sketch it out and cut it out. You used to call me on my life. And then place it on your fabric. You used to, you used to. Yeah. And I just taped it down so it'd be easier to cut out. And then just repeat this process so that you have a few different pieces. And then you just carefully pin down the pieces of fabric as desired, taking care to separate the lining of your dress or garment if it has one. You used to call me on my... you... I'm just sewing it onto the outer part of the garment so that when the lining is down, you can't see any of the stitching on the inside. Call me on my cell phone. And then you just repeat this process for all of the pieces you want to put down, and you're done. So that's it. If you try this out, be sure to tag me in a photo on Instagram or Tumblr, both of those at Wand or use the hashtag 12 days of DIY because it would be really cool to see what you guys come up with. Subscribe if you aren't already so that you can be updated when I post a new video for these next couple of days and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.